one day, I was asked to put in a, what's called a Clinton catheter, a very large catheter for dialysis into a patient. She had stage four breast cancer and was very, very close to death. And um, they wanted to do dialysis because her kidneys had started to fail. I looked up and I saw Pat standing in the doorway. And she was just looking at me with this look of disgust. <laughs> and she went like this. She put her hand up like she was holding a phone and she said, 911, call the police. They're torturing a patient in the ICU at University Hospital. Wow. How did that make you feel? That whole veneer of doubt and question just cracked. And although I didn't let her know it or the patient or the family, I, I realized that I knew this patient was very close to death. It turned out she would end up dying the next day. Um, and I'm ashamed to say that I honestly didn't have the energy, the know-how, the sophistication, the experience to get her off of that end-of-life conveyor belt at that moment. And so I did put that line in, and it certainly did not change her life, but it changed mine.